<laughs> Can you feel it? The glow of comfort, even in the face of crushing despair, must already be sweeping through your body. And in fact, can I say that I do believe the bucket lends you an air of charisma as well? I think that just holding it has made you the slightest bit more attractive as a person. The benefits of the bucket seem to go on and on, don't they? All this and more await you in the Stanley Parable too. I should be the Einstein. Does anyone give out awards for most enjoyable bucket in a video game? That really should be an award if it isn't already. Enjoy new futures. Commissioner. An epilogue would be fun, wouldn't it, Stanley? Yes, yes, it would go at the end of the. Um, uh, well, we'll figure that out later. Yes? Einstellungen Weltmeister. Ich schau mal zu. Your name in the game. For the Stanley Parable 2, I asked myself, what do players really want? And of course, the first and most obvious answer is that they want to be individually recognized and validated as people. So with that in mind, my first addition to the game is this button which speaks the name of the person playing the game. Isn't that wonderful? Sorry, I should have clarified. Right now, the button only says the name Jim. But of course, in the final game, this button will say your name, whatever name that is. Here, let's have you roleplay as Jim to really simulate the full experience of this feature. Just play along. I promise you'll love it. Okay, here we go. Let's take a deep breath, clear your mind, forget whoever you are, and simply become a person named Jim. I want you to imagine yourself... Jim. Whoa, 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 hold on. I wasn't finished setting up the backstory. If you don't properly roleplay as Jim, then you'll never understand the impact of this button. Otherwise, it's just a stupid button that says somebody else's name. Okay, we're doing it again, and this time let me finish first. <clears throat> now, allow yourself to become Jim. Imagine yourself driving to work as Jim. Playing frisbee on the weekends as Jim. Jim. All right, fine, whatever. It's just a meaningless button that says Jim. Are you happy now? Get out of here. I'm done with this button. Why don't you go <laughs> humiliate me in front of a different feature that I worked very hard on? Jim. See, if you'd only played along, that would have been your name, the button says. But no. Instead, oh, I can't even think about it. I'm taking Jim. the Jim button Jim. away. Jim. Jim, 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 Jim. Ah ja, gut. Jetzt renne ich immer noch mit dem tollen Eimer hier in der Gegend rum. 
Maybe I'll only let people named Jim play the Stanley Parable too. They would appreciate what I've created here. Ist Jump Cycle, der geht ja nicht, da haben wir keine Dingsbums. 5 ist diese Mappe, dann haben wir früher Schießmann, das ist ja okay. Äh, mit dem Button haben wir gemacht, Merch Warmer, Settings Warmer, Stanley Bucket haben wir ja immer noch, Office Decorations. Office Decorations ist da hinten, ach da waren wir auch schon. Dann Epilog, ja gut, das ging mir anscheinend nicht. Collectibles, A9, ich glaube da waren wir auch schon, ne? Ja, da waren wir auch schon. Infinity Hall waren wir auch schon, dann gehen wir wieder raus. Exit. Ausgang. Alright, have you seen everything you wanted to? Ready to move on now? So Stanley, what do you think? Do you like all of the new features? Yes, I know it's not exactly clear yet how exactly these features will come together as one single coherent video game, but I can feel it in my soul. It's going to work. There's definitely a good game in there somewhere. Say, let's do an experiment. I'll arrange these new features together and we'll see whether or not it coheres into a meaningful gameplay experience. <laughs> Okay, are you ready? Here it is. I give you the Stanley Parable 2. That's um, no achievement. Well, um, I mean, there's potential here, right? It's sort of... Okay, never mind. Hold on, let me do a different arrangement. Okay, yes, yes, this is much better. I feel good about this. Here we go. Version 2. <sighs> Who am I kidding, Stanley? This isn't a coherent video game at all. It's a lot of gags. And I do very much enjoy creating gags, but they don't add up to anything. I wanted more than anything to create a sequel that would capture all the magic of the first game. I wanted fans to love it. No matter how good these gags are, they won't stand on their own. They would need the structure and the gameplay of the original. Wait, maybe that's it. I can take the original Stanley Parable and simply, well, insert a few of my new features into it. Tastefully, of course. With respect. With care for the vision and integrity of the original game. Would it possibly work? I suppose it could. But it would need a really, really tremendous title screen. A title screen that says with bold and uncompromising conviction, this is the Stanley Parable 2. Let me see if I can whip something up. <laughs> All right, perfect. Go ahead. Take a look. Uh, was? Was? <lacht> oh Mann. Ja, wenn das so ist, dann... Pff, ja. Ja. Sensationell. Wie viele Spielstunden hat das Spiel eigentlich? Ich habe vorhin noch gar nicht reingeguckt. <lacht> 